Let's talk about something I call the critical juncture, okay? And it's a segment, it's a portion of hopefully something you call and have called a pre-shot routine. But this critical juncture is when so many things are happening that are vital to you getting into a position that allows you to perform a great golf shot, okay? So typically, my pre-shot routine starts from behind the golf ball here, and I'll walk in, and one of the first things I'm gonna do is assemble my grip. I'm usually gonna assemble it up here at eye level and check the relationship between my grip, the way I'm holding the golf club, and the face condition, that it's not closed slightly, it's not open slightly, that the leading edge of the golf club, the leading edge of the golf club, the bottom of the golf club is perpendicular to the ground. And then as I move towards the ball, this is the point I call the critical juncture when so many things happen. For example, when I walk in, okay, I sold the club first, okay, that it's properly sitting on the ground, if you will. It's not toe up, it's not heel up. It's sold correctly. And that the face, ready for this one, is facing my intended start line, okay? So I sold it and I aim the face and I check that several times. And notice I'm moving in with an assembled grip and my right foot. Because now also what I'm doing is I'm checking my spacing. For example, if I did this, clearly I'd be too far away. And if I did this, I'd be too close. So I'm creating an orientation of space that feels adequate and feels comfortable where my arms are relaxed and hanging from my shoulders. The club is sold on the ground and aiming. My grip is already assembled. I call that one. I set my left foot down two, and then I spread my right foot three. Okay, let's do that again. Sold and aimed properly. Checking my spacing, getting comfortable. One, two, three, and I'm good to go. So many things are happening right there, right? The club is being put on the ground properly. The face is being aimed. My grip is assembled. I'm checking my spacing, which affects my posture. I spread my feet, one, two, three, into what I hope is a proper ball position. Now, if any time during that juncture, something doesn't feel right, even if I don't know exactly what it is, but it doesn't feel right, I get out and I start again, okay? You know, when you get over that golf ball and something doesn't feel right and you pull the trigger, do you ever hit a good golf shot? Never, right? That's your brain saying to you, abort, get out, okay? The tour player gets out every time knowing that even if they don't know exactly what's wrong, something doesn't feel right and it's not gonna allow you to function the golf swing properly. So getting into the proper orientation and feeling comfortable is the starting or building block of a good, great golf shot. That critical juncture needs to be practiced and understood properly. Better golf.